Another long audio and finally done. Ooh. Ugh. God, these audios really do take out a lot of energy from me. Ugh. Even editing is tiring. You don't even know why it's tiring. I mean, seriously, I'm just here just editing and just talking into it. Like, how does this even take energy out of myself? Well, uh, I did have other things that I needed to do today that I had to do before this, but... Mm. Hmm. What, what the fuck? Okay, I did not expect this, but... <laughs> wow, I can't believe it. An actual listener. <laughs> ah. Oh, don't worry, don't worry. This is just a common mistake. So, yeah. Oh, who am I? I'm the creator of Male Chatter X Listener. Also known as Audio Dork, but you can call me Audio or you can call me Dork. It's up to you, but my original name is Shoya. Nice to meet you. <laughs> Listen, listener, I do not know how to tell you this, but you are a fictional person that is supposed to be a person who is listening to my recent audios, but of course, I guess something weird happened? Don't worry. I'll get you back to your original universe in no time. Oh. Looks like it's gonna have to take a long time. Oh, I don't even have enough energy to send you back. I'm tired. Well, of course I don't have enough to send you back. I mean, seriously, I just spent all my energy on making an... audio. Wait a second. <laughs> I see what's going on. Well, this is certainly a surprise for me and a surprise for you. I guess the universe just wants me to jerk around or something. <laughs> With yeah. I mean, most of my viewers are mostly attracted to male chatta, such as yourself. You're supposed to be the main character of the story, and also chatta is too, but... Eh, fuck him. Seriously, I'm getting tired of people simping for him most of the time. I mean, seriously. I have other quests I need to do. Like, I can't just sit around in my room all day thinking about plot lines between male chatta and Frisk or some other characters. That could possibly get his plot. I mean, seriously, you really expect me to do all that shit? <laughs> of course they do. Oh, why does my voice have an echo? <laughs> well, that's kind of something that is due to my character plot. You see, my identity is supposed to be kept a secret. You know, a real life stuff, you can't reveal yourself on the internet and shit, and yeah. So, I decided to create myself like this. Don't worry, everything's fine. But, yet again, just know that I'm merely a puppet of the original creator. My eyes aren't exactly the same as theirs. Once you see under this mask, let's just say that you will regret it. Or, should I say, regret ever seeing my face. <laughs> Do gotta say, though, it is pretty fun to tease you every now and then. <sighs> Seriously, watching all your reactions is just adorable. Oh, you really think I don't... <laughs> oh my goodness. You really think I don't look into that shit? Dude, I mean, seriously, I look into many timelines of where Audio Dork, or should I say my creator, has made within their audios and stuff. You cannot believe how many times where I saw so many comments being flustered. If the comments are flustered, then so are you. 
Yeah, they only make you dominant because, yeah. <sighs> Sorry, just need to apply something real quick. Ugh, dang, this stinks. Hmm? Oh, don't, don't mind me. It's just something that I have to apply usually. <laughs> of course you see this. I mean, seriously, if I'm hurt, then yeah, who cares? <sighs> of course, you're the listener. You're supposed to care. But yet again, still, what does that change? Hmm, I can even adjust myself to someone you like, such as Mel Chata, if you like. But of course, I don't feel like turning into him now, and also, due to my low energy, I can't turn any into anyone else, sadly. Oh yeah, I have many things that I am available to do, due to the creator's permissions, of course, and to their decisions, such as their audios. I mean, don't get me wrong, I like helping out every now and then, but hey, it just gets very tiring. Many of the people help out once and again, but yeah, I even had to turn into Calvin for God's sakes. <sighs> and of course, I gotta say, people, I'm pretty surprised that people are into him. I didn't expect people to be into Western guys these days, due to the fact that I've seen many people online have different tastes. And believe me, they are weird as hell. You're asking me what my taste is? <laughs> oh my goodness, listener, you're so funny. Here's the thing, I don't have tastes. I'm not supposed to have one. I'm not even supposed to exist. In fact, I'm only here existing because of my creator. <sighs> you ought to understand what's going on here. I don't even know why my creator is even doing this in the first place. Keeping you with me? I mean, seriously, that ought to be one of the biggest mistakes of their lives. Once the creator finds out that you're gone, uh, I bet all hell's gonna break loose. I mean, don't get me wrong, they like a little bit of chaos every now and then, but not this type of chaos. They can barely control the universe themselves. I mean, seriously, how in the real world, it's very difficult. But here, they have all the control they want. And of course, they tend to make whatever the listeners want, such as you. You're the person who is supposed to be listening to this or some shit. Perhaps you're listening to this right now due to the fact that you're here. I wonder if my creator is planning any of this. This is starting to get me worried. Ugh. But, yeah, in the end, I'm just a nobody. I'm just an empty script. A blank canvas. Just a design. That's all I am. Just a cover-up. You say I'm more, but I believe that's what you're doing is comforting. I don't need such pitiful things. I don't like to say much of this stuff because it'll give me some pitiful looks. But just know that I don't need anyone's pity. I'm just here to work. And do as my creator tells me to. And besides, they're the ones that created me. <sighs> and also, I shouldn't be caring more about the listener more than what we're dubbing or some shit. I mean, seriously, if I get attached to someone, then that'll be a huge, huge problem. Mm. <laughs> you seem to already be getting attached to me already. I mean, there's no need to. You could always go for another person, such as Chada, Calvin, Monica, Etc., etc., and yeah. T 
Why go for me of all people? What's your goal here? Hmm? To romance me? Use the power of love against me? Or it's just something a little more devious? <laughs> I'm sorry. I like teasing you. But I bet you wouldn't mind if we done something devious here. Not like I give a crap or anything. Hmm. In fact, what will happen if I just kiss you right now? What then? Would it escalate to something more devious, or would it just remain just a kiss? Who knows? I'm incapable of feeling. I think. Or am I? So many questions unanswered. <sighs> But yet again, I'm just a vessel for the Creator, and yeah, that's just that. Huh? That's odd. My voice echo. It's gone. Huh. It doesn't usually go away unless I command it to, or just force it to. Believe me, it's very difficult. But <laughs> you think it's because of you? Oh, jeez, human, don't make me laugh. <sighs> I'm incapable of feeling. Remember? <sighs> Who am I kidding? I mean, you don't know what the consequences may be if you ever get to know me. You know. <laughs> You're getting a little too close for my liking. But yet again, my creator isn't here, so I'm not there for the judge. Hmm. Now that I'm thinking about it, I don't think she. No, sorry. I used the wrong pronouns for for them. Why am I messing up all of a sudden? In fact, I don't think my creator is here at all. Maybe that's why something's happening, <sighs> or something worse. This is very strange. Hmm. You know. How about? No, I shouldn't. Why am I not allowed to put my hands on you? Just tracing your hands up and down your body. <laughs> just one finger, just going up and down, teasing you and everything. Yet again, I could just be teasing you for all I know. <laughs> oh, I want to do that—the devious thing. Uh, you may be, you may be, right or wrong. Who cares? But yet again, I could be wrong in saying that I do not have feelings for you. I mean, I have voiced a couple of the characters, and I've seen how you truly are and your true intentions from each and every audio. To be honest, I don't know how I'm feeling. <laughs> I could be feeling devious for you, anytime and anywhere. <laughs> Seeing your face getting ra that red, it's adorable. <clears throat> well, I'm getting a little too carried away. Hmm. Unless you want me to continue. <laughs> Yet again, I could just be taking advantage of you because I'm bored. Mm. Mm. But you kind of like being teased, don't you? Even after all that, you still insist that you don't like it. But in reality, you do. I could just be doing whatever I want with you, anytime, anytime I want. You know what? Scratch that. 
I could be doing it to you right now. <laughs> Sorry I'm being a bit of a tease, but I can't help myself. Mm. Tempting, but no thank you. Anyways, time's up. I'll see you in the next audio, little listener. Also, I might bring you back just because I want to have some fun. Adios!